Hi friends, today I am going to teach you tools, Adobe XT tools. Okay, first we can go with selection tool. Okay, this is a shortcut is V. Okay, this option if you want to move the element, you can move okay and if you want to duplicate the artboard click on the selection tool click here press alt and move it okay okay guys next i hope you understood we can move to next tool it's a rectangle tool i am drawing one rect one rectangle c you can draw like this see if i will press shift what will happen we can see see we will get perfect one rectangle here okay i'm going to select first selection tool see i can move this to here also i already drawn one rectangle here so click this node you can curve like this i got one button okay you can create like this one button also when you are creating website and mobile apps so many things we are going to do so that time it's very easy to create a button okay and this part i will teach you in the next video okay guys and we can go to next tool that is ellipse shortcut is e see i'm drawing like this like this if i will press shift I will get one perfect circle. Okay. I will click on selection tool and I will press Alt. I will move to this page. Okay. This is very easy, right? So I am going to next tool that is polygon. Why? You can draw like this if I press shift you will get perfect direct, uh, sorry triangle you can curl the edges and you can do it circle also with this and next tool is line you can draw a line if you will press shift you will get straight straight line see I'm drawing horizontal vertical and next tool is pen tool Sh shortcut is p c i think i no need to explain about pen tool because this is very basic tool you can see it in illustrator photoshop indesign everywhere you can see this tool i am not going to explain more about pen tool I think you already know that okay i'm so i'm going next tool that is text see hi select select this and drag like this you can increase the size you, but if you want you can do it like this also just type it here okay i already told you this part i'm not going to teach you now in the next video i'm going to teach this so please wait i already told you you can increase like this also font size 
or else if you want you can give it here and you can bold bold the text okay or medium light everything will be here and you can center align it you can change the color okay this one i will teach you in the next video and we will go to next uh, tool so that is artboard yeah so if i'll click the artboard i will get so many sizes here so i want to take iphone 6 so i will click see i got artboard here i am no need to create any other thing other file so i got it here so if i want create one website so website size also here this here only see one file you will get different sizes you can use different sizes here so that is very easy right and next one is zoom see click this and you can zoom it like this if you don't want to zoom you want to zoom out press alt you can press alt and click see you can zoom out or else command plus you can zoom it command minus okay i hope you understood all these tools selection tool rectangle tool ellipse polygon line pen tool text artboard and zoom it's everything is clear right so next tool that is library see this one uh, if you upload it here you can use the icon for example icons you can use that icons in your next project also and this one present project assets everything you will you can add it here see for example i am going to add i am going to add this text here see 260 so i will do it see i will make it 36 okay and i will duplicate it again 24 sorry 24 again i will duplicate it to 14 see we'll see what will happen i will add it here see you have to observe it it's all different sizes okay so welcome okay already added text i want font size this font size should be in 260 it's very weak okay I don't want I want 36 see you can change it 14 24 like that okay once you add in assets you can use that font size in your next text also okay see I will draw one rectangle so i want i will change the color to blue okay i will add this color to asset because here stroke also is there so that gray color also 
is showing here okay i will duplicate this rectangle and i will hide this and i will change the color see okay and i will again i will add it let's see what will happen okay again i will draw one rectangle or circle i will draw one circle see okay i want i will remove the border and select this i want pink color so i will select it here see it's very easy right whenever in see this is website artboard if i will draw one circle i can select this color okay like that you can uh, so many things are there you can just explore it and next one is layers see in this artboard i have created only one circle so it's showing here in this nothing is there see here you can see all assets whatever you have used here everything is showing here and last one is plugins okay discover plugin okay you will get so many plugins here all assets icons illustrations all assets you will get it here so just go through this you will get more idea about this okay guys i hope you understood all the tools clearly if you have any doubt you can comment it and thank you for watching this video